turnaround for beach men's volleyball, culminating in a finals appearance in his senior season in 1990. Long Beach State had gone 33 wins and 34 losses in the two preceding seasons of Mark's arrival at the beach, and after an 18-15 record in his freshman year, the beach would go on to win 20 matches in 1988 and top that win total in each of the next two seasons. The first time in our history that the 49ers had won more than 20 matches. As the veteran star of those teams, Mark led the 49ers in kills in 1989 and was second behind fellow Hall of Famer Ren Hilliard in 1990. His 1,700 kills ranked fourth in school history and his 832 career digs ranked rank second. His all-around volleyball skills are amplified by career totals of 72 solo blocks, 223 block assists, and 79 service aces. Mark was also the winner of our Bill Bovey Determination Award in 1990. With stats like that, it's a little surprise that Mark was an all-conference first team in 1990 and second team in 1989. Similarly, a first team All-American in 1990 and a second team in 1989, as well as a member of the NC2A's all tournament team in 1990. Mark went on to join the U.S. national team in 1991-92 and was an inaugural member of the Long Beach State Men's Volleyball Wall of Honor. He also enjoyed success in professional volleyball with the AVP and was a nominee for the Rookie of the Year Award in 1993. He retired from the Pro Beach Circuit in the year 2000. Mark now lives in Laguna de Gale with his wife, Gabrielle, serves as an integrated document solution consultant for Reynolds & Reynolds, Karen's oldest daughter, Summer, is now playing volleyball for Cal State Fullerton, while her sister, Katie, plays at Alicia and Miguel High. Mark's proud parents, Ken and Ellen, are also here. Mark says his time spent at Long Beach State molded him into the person he is today, quite a person and still quite a volleyball player. Please join in welcoming the guy who was the key in turning around men's volleyball fortunes while becoming an All-American on our 1990 NC2A finalist team, Mark Karen's. that I've taken away from my time at Long Beach State 
is I got there good, I grew up, and I came out there much, much better. So that's what Long Beach State did for me, and I owe that to Long Beach State. Some of you may, uh, may know and may not know that uh, I have a nickname. Um, I don't know if I'm proud of it or not, but it's called Hammerhead. <laughs> I don't know why they called me that. Uh, Mike Del Sandro, I think, maybe gave me that moniker. And it could be because I hit the ball really hard. It could be I have a really hard head. Or I'm hard-headed. Uh, I'm not sure. You're going to have to ask those guys what it really means. But uh, <laughs> at our banquet, um, just to give you an idea of what it does mean is, um, I received a hammer. And uh, I'll, I'll let you guys describe that. <laughs> um, so what I'd like to say about Longview State is, I've had the ability to to compete, to play the sport I love. I still love it today, um, and I hope to be able to play for the rest of my life. And I want to say thank you to Long Beach State for everything that you guys have helped me to become. Friends, family, um, I have so many great friends, and so many of you guys are here tonight. You have no idea what that means to me to actually have you here. It, uh, it's embedded in my soul forever. So I want to say thank you to all of you. And I'd like to do one thing here. Uh, I haven't heard this for a while, but uh, back when we played, there was this cheer. And it went F-O-R-T-Y dash. You guys know that one? All right, well, I want to hear it. Do it with me, all right? It starts like this. It goes, oh, F-O-R-T-Y dash N-I-N-E-R-S 40 Niners Volleyball. Go Beach. Go Beach! Go Beach! Go Beach! Okay, well, one more time. <laughs> now that I did it, let's have all you guys do it. Can you do it for me? One more time. Uh, F O R C Y dash N I N E R S 40 Scottish Football. Go Beach! Go Beach! Go Beach! Go Beach! Go beach.